Hey, this is Dell with Dell's Lawn Care over here working on his trailer for the giveaway. But for now, you're watching Lanier Lawn Care. What's going on, guys? Danny with Lanier Lawn Care. Today, I want to show you how to change your padlock on your Green Touch trimmer racks. guys so the things you're going to need in order to install this new padlock is a 16 millimeter wrench or ratchet and as you can tell I've got some padlocks over here we'll go over why I have so many but you're going to need a new padlock to replace this with so how we get started all right guys if you notice there's a bolt in the back of your trimmer rack we're going to pull this bolt out with our 16 millimeter. The next step is going to be simply take this handle and turn it all the way to the right toward the front of your engine supports. Well, next step you're just going to simply make sure your lock is unlocked and pull it straight out. Now that you've got your lock pulled out, this is what it should look like. Now, all you simply do is rotate your lock, pull up on it, and pull it out. Now, all you simply want to do is grab your replacement lock, slide the open end in here, turn it down in, and twist it. Now that we got our new lock in, with your handle still rotated up top, slide your new lock in, twist your handle to the lock position, and make sure that it's not gonna come out. Now you're gonna take your 16 millimeter boat, you're gonna go to the back of the rack again, and you're gonna put your boat back in. Now, when you lock it, your rack should not move and stay in the locked position. It's that simple. Now we're going to go over why I have so many locks. If you read the instruction manual for this, it says to pick a number three master lock. So here I have a number three master lock. We're going to unlock it install it and put it in move it a little bit there we go now turn your handle pull on your lock it shouldn't come out now here's the problem with this particular number three master lock you push it in it's locked yet I can still turn my handle to unlock my trimmers. The problem lies in the fact <clears throat> that this part right here is too long perfectly wide it's too long and therefore it don't lock the racks properly next we have what seems to be a Brinks lock it's a 40 millimeter body just like the original lock that comes with the rack and it seemed to match pretty perfect
So we take it and we put it in here. And as you notice, it's too wide. It will not work. It will not go down in there to work. So, we went a step further and went and bought another lock that was pretty much, now this one's open, mind you, pretty much identical. When you put them back to back, they looked pretty much the same with this lock. Same 40 millimeter body. Yet, we have the same problem. Still, it won't go down. Now a bunch of people you say, grind this out a little bit or something. This is so thin, I don't wanna touch it. So, there's three locks we went and purchased that do not work. Mind you, that master lock is a $13 lock. Their lock fits perfect. Make sure you get the right width and the right length with a 40 millimeter body if you want it to fit exactly like theirs does. Tighten our 16 millimeter bolt back up. Now, when we lock it, their lock stays locked. So my suggestion is either A, <clears throat> keep this lock lubed up with dry lube or a three in one dry lube or something to where it holds up to the elements. Or B, call Green Touch and find out how much they will send you a new lock for with shipping to replace it. I have went to Sutherland's, Home Depot, Lowe's, Walmart uh, and Menards looking for a lock exactly like this and this size. I have not found one yet, not one. So any number three master lock will not work. Just remember, take your old lock with you. If you still can't find one and you need to replace your lock, call Green Touch, have them send you a new lock if they will. You'll probably end up paying $15 for the lock and shipping, but it's a lock. Take care of the next one. You won't have the same problem I did with trying to go through all the trouble of finding another one. So that is how you replace the lock on your Green Touch Trimmer X. Hope this helped guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you in the next video.